A hearing impaired man is struggling with the loss of his service dog who died in last week's severe flooding. His co-workers have started a GoFundMe campaign to get him another companion. News Channel 15's Kai Torpesoa met with a man and he's in Studio 15 with more. Last Wednesday, Christian Copper's service dog Sportster was in her kennel in the basement. Copper rushed home to save her once he realized how intense the rain was getting. But he couldn't get down there because the water had flooded all the way to the top of the stairs. He was too late. Christian Copper has lost his best friend of eight years, a German shepherd named Sportster. I have no family. Uh, this, all I have is this home. I'm she was my girl. It's very lonely here without her. She drowned in his basement after severe flooding consumed his southeast Fort Wayne neighborhood. Copper was out with his girlfriend. He didn't expect the rain to become so fierce. I come and uh, the rain heavy, heavy, and I said, I gotta go home and get my dog. And then you saw the lake, like I tried, and it was too late. Got the sewer lids off. I could do no more, so I left. I was very distraught about my dog. Copper says Sportster was the reason he could function as a deaf man in the world. She let him know when someone was at his front door. When he was getting a phone call, she went everywhere with him. He says he can't even think about replacing her just yet. Sportster was his world. No dog ever made me laugh as much as Sportster did. Uh, from some of the photos, you will see she... Uh, laid in funny positions. Uh, she had the most beautiful eyes that would just make you grin no matter what kind of a day you was having. All she did was want me. She waited for me to come home all day and uh, that's all she wanted to do. If, if she was with us right now, she'd be sitting right here. Uh, the companionship that she gave me is irreplaceable. I love her very much and I always will. If you'd like to donate to the GoFundMe campaign to help Copper get a new service dog, find this story on Wayne.com. Kaito Pessoa, News Channel 15.